What's up, Panda Nation? Coffee or die, babies. Hey, look what I got. Another package from Black Rifle Coffee. Just bought another uh, one of their roasts. And I thought I'd go dark this time, man. I thought I would try something not in the mild or medium blend. Hey, look, they have a club too. Never run out of coffee. So check that out. Black Rifle Coffee, stick around. If you do want to order some Black Rifle Coffee, check out the link that I'll put below. Apparently, I think it gets you like 10% off your next order. So, you know, might as well use it. Or pay you the full thing, I don't care. You know, I, I like the guys at Black Rifle Coffee. Veteran owned, operated, and employing. And so you do get uh, former uh, military in jobs that uh, should be fun with other guys that understand uh, kind of... Um, what they've what they've sacrificed and uh, kind of been able to you know have some camaraderie I think with uh, like-minded people so it's pretty cool anyway Black Rifle Coffee Company this one is uh, the coffee or die 12 ounces ground and as you can see the whole, the whole nine yards and supporting veterans and law enforcement organizations so the coffee or die is a dark blend, and it's a blend of Central American and Colombian Supremo, I think. So, should be stronger, richer, more robusto, and uh, kick me in the face as I'm drinking it. Uh, which I can totally handle, because I'm, I'm, a, I'm a dude. I'm a man's man. Let's try this coffee out. Alright guys, got it set up here in my dark rose coffee or die. Opened it up, let's pour a little bit of the, the grounds in the... The old hand dripper here and then let's get some of the uh, boiled water here and start pouring it over it all right guys there you have it uh, went ahead and hand dripped a cup of the coffee or die still really hot just take a quick sip here mmm Woo! Yeah, that's a darker roast, man. Definitely more punch to it. But God, is it good. I'll tell you what. Um, I think this is maybe the right one for most people. Because you might be saying, Peter, I like a medium roast. I do too. You know, I don't like it really burning. Yet. But I guess what I'm say saying is this compared to the standard starbucks roast is smoother than that and maybe it's just the smoothness that i'm talking about but first of all it doesn't taste as burnt you know so uh starbucks coffee has that kind of that burnt taste and this is still smooth it's strong though and it's good uh but man no aftertaste or anything like that no kind of bitterness or or you know kind of a chemically uh you know taste on your on your tongue it just tastes great and I'll be honest, between this and like the Starbucks normal roast, this even seems a little milder than that. So I'm assuming maybe the extra dark is kind of maybe going to be kind of that burnt, you know, really almost uh, charred like coffee. But man, this is great. And I think actually for most people, if you go with this dark roast, use this as kind of the base for your coffee. I think you're going to be super happy with it. If you dress it up with sugar cream or a Snickers bar or something like that too, man, it's going to just be a phenomenal treat. But holy smokes, yeah, that is a good cup of coffee. Man, it's it's great on the tongue. It goes down. No aftertaste. Uh, you know, it's just, God, it's smooth. I mean, some of the best coffee I've ever had. So check it out. Support the boys at uh, Black Rifle Coffee Company. I'll put a link to it in the description so that you can save yourself a little bit of money when you order it. But, man, I do love it. Peter Von Panda. Out.